structure of the database with the help of a diagram which is known as entity relationship diagram that is our er diagram an er model is a design or blueprint of a database that can later be implemented as a database the main component of er model are entity set and relationship set entity is nothing but a thing in the real world with an independent existence it is a thing or object what i say entity is a thing or object that has its own identity or that can be identified easily an entity may be an object with physical existence for example house person or with a conceptual existence for example course job here uh, entity is represented by symbol rectangle now what is entity entity are the real world object that exist and can be distinguished from one another it can be place organization things etc it can be even a person event plan the important feature of the entity is that it has got attributes the best example of entity is person entity it's having attributes like person name address contact number date of birth next example here is student students having number of attributes like roll number name of student address gender contact number etc next key concept here is attribute attribute are nothing but the properties of the entities for example if the client is an entity then its attributes can be its id client id name address the next one is entity set when there are number of same type of entities that share the common properties or attribute such collection of entities is called as entity set for example person books having same attribute or properties like name of person address contact number age like in simple word properties attribute means properties that describe the entities for example if i have entity person the properties will describe the particular entity would be the name age address phone number etc these are called as attributes of a person it is represented by oval symbol there are various types of attribute composite attribute simple attribute single value attribute multi value attribute derived attribute etc relationship it can be defined as association among several entities as i said relationship tells how one entity is related to the another entity relationship can have attribute as well the set of similar type of relationship is called as set of relationship in relationship set the number of entities can be more than 2 the relationship is a natural association that exists between one or more entity in simple word relationship is association among two or more entities for example teacher teaches student here we have two entities first one is teacher and second one is student and teaches is a relationship between these two entities the relationship connects these two entities that is teach student and student these two are entities there are various types of relationship unary relationship binary rela- relationship and ternary relationship in unary relationship it exists when there is an association with only one entity for example only one entity is related with itself that is unary relationship in binary relationship if it exists when there is an association among two entities the best example here is publisher publish book here two entities that are linked together called as binary relationship it is also called as degree to relationship here publisher and book these are two entity and publishes is a single relationship 
थर्ड वन इज अ टर्नरी रिलेशनशिप इट एक्जिस्ट वेन देर इज एन असोसिएशन अमॉन्ग थ्री एंटिटीज फर्स्ट एंटिटी हेयर इज सब्जेक्ट टीचर्स स्टूडेंट एंड टीचर टीचर्स स्टूडेंट टीचर टीचर्स स्टूडेंट दैट इज टीचर इज अ वन एंटिटी स्टूडेंट इज अन अदर एंटिटी एंड थर्ड वन सब्जेक्ट इज अ थर्ड एंटिटी विथ सिंगल टीचर्स रिलेशनशिप इट इज कॉल्ड एज टनर रिलेशनशिप और डिग्री थ्री रिलेशनशिप वॉट इज एन एंटिटी रिलेशनशिप डायग्राम एंड यह डायग्राम शोज और द एंटिटी रिलेशनशिप डायग्राम इट शोज अ रिलेशनशिप अमॉ एंटिटी सेट्स एंड एंटिटी सेट इज अ ग्रुप ऑफ सिमिलर एंटिटीज वॉट इज एंटिटी सेट इट इज नथिंग बट अ ग्रुप ऑफ सिमिलर एंटिटीज एंड दीज एंटिटीज कैन हैव एट्रीब्यूट्स इन टर्म्स ऑफ डी बी एम एस एंड एंटिटी इज अ टेबल और एट्रीब्यूट ऑफ अ टेबल इन अ डेटा बेस सो बाय शोइंग रिलेशनशिप अमॉन्ग टेबल्स एंड देयर एट्रीब्यूट्स इयर डायग्राम शोज द कम्प्लीट लॉजिकल स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ अ डेटा बेस लेट्स हैव अ लुक एट अ सिंपल इयर डायग्राम टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस कंसेप्ट हेयर सैम्पल इयर डायग्राम इट शोज द टू एंटिटीज फर्स्ट वन इज स्टूडेंट सेकेंड वन इज कॉलेज स्टूडेंट स्टडी इन कॉलेज हेयर रिलेशनशिप एक्जिस्ट स्टडी स्टूडेंट हैविंग थ्री एट्रीब्यूट्स फर्स्ट स्टूडेंट आई डी सेकेंड स्टूडेंट नेम थर्ड वन स्टूडेंट एड्रेस एंड कॉलेज एंटिटी इट्स हैविंग टू एट्रीब्यूट्स फर्स्ट वन इज कॉलेज आई डी एंड कॉलेज नेम लेफ्ट अनादर एग्जाम्पल हेयर इज ई आर डायग्राम फॉर कस्टमर एंड लोन कस्टमर इज अ वन एंटिटी एंड लोन इज अनादर कस्टमर हैविंग थ्री एट्रीब्यूट्स और प्रॉपर्टीज फर्स्ट वन कस्टमर आई डी सेकेंड नेम एंड एड्रेस एंड सेकेंड एंटिटी लोन इट्स हैविंग अमाउंट लोन आई डी कस्टमर आई डी लोन टाइप दीज आर द एट्रीब्यूट्स एंड देर एक्जिस्ट वन रिलेशनशिप दैट इज कॉल्ड एज ओन एट्रीब्यूट फॉर एग्जाम्पल कस्टमर आई डी डेट बारो कोड लोन एंड डेट दीज आर सम फीचर्स ऑफ ई आर डायग्राम और ई आर मॉडल फर्स्ट वन इयर इज ई आर डायग्राम यूज फॉर रिप्रेजेंटिंग ई आर मॉडल इट कैन बी इजीली कन्वर्ट इन टू द रिलेशन द ई आर मॉडल इज यूज फॉर द पर्पज ऑफ गुड डेटा बेस डिजाइन बाय द डेटा बेस डेवलपर सो टू यूज दैट डेटा मॉडल इन वेरियस एप्लीकेशंस थर्ड वन इट इज इनहेरेंटली एंड इंटरैक्टिव प्रोसेस फोर्थ वन इट इज वेरी सिंपल एंड इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड बाय वेरियस टाइप ऑफ यूजर एंड एंड डिजाइनर बिकॉज ऑफ स्पेसिफिक स्टैंडर्ड यूज फॉर द प्रेजेंटेशन again some listed features are it is used for it can be easily converted into relations relation is nothing but a table in relational model er model is used for the purpose of good database design by the database developer so to use that data model in various dbms applications it is helpful as a problem decomposition tool as it shows the entities and relationship between those entity it is inherent and iterative process it is very simple and easy various components used in er model first one rectangle and it is it represent entity and entity set ellipse it represent attributes third one here is diamond it represent relationship set these are some listed component of er model first rectangle represent set of entity double rectangle represent weak entity set oval represent attribute double oval represent multi value attribute dotted oval represent derived attribute diamond represent relationship double diamond represent big entity set oval with underline represent primary key attribute 
डॉटेड लाइन रिप्रेजेंट वीक एंटिटी एट्रीब्यूट एज ए सेड एंटिटी इज एन ऑब्जेक्ट और कंपोनेंट ऑफ डेटा एन एंटिटी इज रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय रेक्टेंगल इन ईयर डायग्राम देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ एंटिटी स्ट्रॉन्ग एंटिटी एंड वीक एंटिटी स्ट्रॉन्ग एंटिटी मीन्स द एंटिटी सेट दैट हैज अ प्राइमरी की इज कॉल्ड एज स्ट्रॉन्ग एंटिटी सेट सपोज इन माई ईयर डायग्राम रोल नंबर इज माय प्राइमरी की हेयर द स्ट्रॉन्ग एंटिटी इज ईयर डायग्राम that is roll number weak entity set the entity set which does not have sufficient attribute to form a primary key is called as weak entity set that is remaining attribute that is phone number address is the best example of weak entity set attribute simple attribute composite attribute single value multi value derived attribute null attribute let's see all the attributes all the data relating to an entity is held in its attributes an attribute is nothing but a property of an entity an entity is represented by a set of attribute that is descriptive properties possessed by all members of entity set domain is the set of permitted value for each attribute and as follows simple one attribute simple attribute is nothing but it is one that consists of a single atomic value a simple attribute cannot be subdivided for example age gender city these are the best example of simple attribute means it is a single atomic value it cannot be decomposed further second one is a composite attribute it is an attribute that can be further subdivided in composite attribute there are generally set of sub attribute the best example here is name of a student name attribute may have first name middle name and last name the name is sub divided into three sub attribute that is called composite attribute next one is single value attribute it can have only a single value for example a person can have only one date of birth or age but single value but a single value attribute can be simple or composite attribute that is date of birth is a composite attribute and age is a sim- simple attribute but both are single multi value attribute means attribute can have multiple values for example a person can have multiple phone numbers multiple degree etc next one is derived attribute the value for the derived attribute is computed or determined from the stored attribute for example date of birth of a person is a stored attribute the value for the attribute age can be calculated by subtracting the date of birth from the current day in this case we say that the age is a derived attribute an attribute that value is derived from a stored attribute is called as derived attribute the best example here is of a person that is derived from a date of birth next one is null attribute null value is stored when an entity does not have a value for an attribute null can also designate that an attribute is unknown that is missing or not known it is called as null attribute here null is for example student id name age phone number let's take an example of simple table the person who has who has a who has landline phone will will have for that attribute phone number or landline number but the person who has no landline phone number that is will it will be the null value in that attribute field for this particular case meaning of null means not applicable null can also be used when we don't know the value of attribute for example we don't know the phone number of particular in, uh, person meaning of null would be the unknown 
इट कैन बी क्लासीफाइड इंटू टू केसेस वेन वैल्यू इज एग्जिस्ट बट इट इज मिसिंग लाइक फॉर एग्जाम्पल एज ऑफ पर्सन इज एग्जिस्ट बट इट इज मिसिंग दैट इज वैल्यू वुड बी द मिसिंग दैट मीन्स इट इज नल वेन सेकेंड केस इज इट इज नॉट नोन इफ द वैल्यू एग्जिस्ट और नॉट फॉर एग्जाम्पल वी डोंट नो द स्टूडेंट फॉर एग्जाम्पल टॉम हैज फोन नंबर और नॉट दैट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ एट्रीब्यूट वुड बी द नल की एट्रीब्यूट अ की एट्रीब्यूट कैन यूनिकली आइडेंटिफाई एन एंटिटी फ्रॉम एन एंटिटी सेट फॉर एग्जाम्पल रोल नंबर रोल नंबर एयर इज अ की एट्रीब्यूट एज शोन इन गिवन फिगर एयर स्टूडेंट इज अ वन एंटिटी इट्स हैविंग फाइव एट्रीब्यूट्स फर्स्ट वन इज रोल नंबर सेकेंड वन नेम एड्रेस डेट ऑफ बर्थ एंड कॉन्टैक्ट नंबर एयर कॉन्टैक्ट नंबर इज अ की एट्रीब्यूट दैट मीन्स कॉन्टैक्ट नंबर नो इट्स रॉन्ग रोल नंबर इज अ की एट्रीब्यूट दैट कैन यूनिकली आइडेंटिफाई इच रिकॉर्ड ऑफ अ स्टूडेंट key attribute here is a roll number that can uniquely identify an entity from an entity set second one is a composite attribute an attribute that is a combination of other attribute is known as composite attribute here the example of composite attribute are name student name it's having further decomposed into the first name middle name and last name it is called as composite attribute third one is derived attribute a derived attribute is one whose dash oval in er diagram here age of a student can be derived from date of birth which is stored in our database date of birth from date of birth we can calculate the age of particular student that is called as derived attribute age can be derived from date of birth that is called as derived attribute and it is represented by dashed oval fourth one is multi value attribute an attribute that can hold multiple values is known as multi value attribute here contact number is a multi value attribute and it is represented by double oval in a er diagram student having multiple phone number or contact number that is called as multi value attribute thank you this is all about er diagram